what is going on my friends welcome back to another video and in this video we are talking about something that this fella behind me needs some help with look he's working on a telesto so things can't be right over there down in banshee country he got some serious problems and bungie need to change some stuff and we're going to talk about that in this here video right now now before we get into the video or before we go any further i do have one or two quick favors to ask of you first one is to simply leave a thumbs up on the video if you like my content and you want to support my channel the second one is join my discord there's a link down below in the description and the last one is drop me a follow on my live stream twitch.tv forward slash shake i stream live every single day over there on twitch so make sure you drop me a follow and check out some streams and with that we are ready to get into our video now what are we talking about we're talking about banshee and just basically banshee's whole system is really out of whack right now if you guys haven't noticed it takes a very and i mean very long time to get yourself some loot from banshee these days it takes an absolute eternity in fact i want an engram from you brother what do i have to give you that's my main problem is it just takes way too long to rank this guy up and way too long to get weapons to drop from him they obviously made a big change last season i believe it was and they removed gunsmith materials from the game so you no longer could trade those in to get stuff from banshee you can see here on the second page he does have a weekly offering of weapons i believe this system could be greatly expanded upon and not only that they could curate what they offer each week because look i mean look at what we've got here there's, there's just nothing worth a damn here this is all just garbo loot unfortunately now there are a couple of new weapons that have been introduced this season as far as world drop goes the first one that comes to mind is the nod this is basically a new version of the antioch d right now you could make that thing front and center of the gunsmith he could be the guy to go to if you want to get yourself an nod and when you rank up you can maybe select one and get one with random rolls or it could be one of the other newer weapons maybe the new scout rifle we've got a new azumi or sorry a new omelon sniper rifle in the game as well i believe called the galu rr3 that could take front and center you had the cantata from last season that was very sought after you could make the gunsmith basically away in order to target farm those kinds of weapons maybe every single week you would have one of them here and you could let it after you know leveling up a couple of times but the problem is the leveling up system takes so long and as it stands in fact i'm going to show this to you guys just because i think it's a much more effective example so let's head over to my vault and what we're going to do is we're going to delete some stuff now but you know i've got i've got stuff here that i can definitely get rid of that i no longer need some of these will be some controversial choices for you guys i know i have some sunset weapons here and you're probably like why don't you delete those but i've just got a ton of like surplus rolls on different weapons like for example this piece bound okay so we delete it and look at my progress plus three gunsmith rank progress like that is kind of nuts guys it really really is kind of actually just bonkers all right we're gonna get rid of this fractor test boom look at my progress man yeah i would have to delete my entire vault to level up a single time <laughs> like what is going on but i don't even know why i have this let's delete let's delete this as well all right get rid of that thing get rid of this get rid of that and we'll get rid of this and look at my rank it's not even gone up barely at all <laughs> basically when you do finally level him up you could just literally get something like this a palladies corrected with field prep so grindy to get weapons from this guy and then when you finally get one it could literally be you know a steady hand typhon gl5 <laughs> even doing the bounties it's really not that much worth it like i could go and knock out all these bounties and i'm still not going to be that much closer to uh to getting this done in fact i'm going to do that and then we'll see exactly where we stand all right so i'm back and i've done a bunch of bounties for the gunsmith so let's take a look at how much rep we get so bear in mind some of these are advanced calibration bounties you can get from them from extra bounties they don't provide you any rank up only the ones that are available on the daily rotation will give you rank up let's just get those out of the way and take the xp now these are our four daily bounties now look at that i just did four bounties and i dismantled fair few guns and look at where our rank is at this is just crazy no one can tell me that this makes a whole lot of sense because i i i don't understand i i just i don't get it i have one weapon available let's see what we get <laughs> we got a typhon gl5 and it sucks 
May, uh, yeah, it probably sucks. Explosive light, thinking of an orb. Okay, maybe this could be good in PvE, maybe. I don't know. But the point is, it's very, very grindy for very little reward. They need to focus the new seasonal world weapon drops to be guaranteed drops from the gunsmith and maybe even expand the crafting system and have gunsmith collaborate with the crafting table over on the other planet, wherever it is, in the enclave or whatever that is. He needs to get in involved in the crafting. We need more bounties. This thing, this is just not it. The gunsmith feels way worse now than it did before. You know, before, if I fancied having a chance at a bunch of world drops, I'd usually have plenty of materials on hand. I would turn a bunch in and I would get a couple of guns that I'd like. Now, it's it, he, he's just basically impossible to get anything from unless he sells it with the exact role that you want. So yeah, it's a short little video just saying that our boy Banshee needs some help because the system right now, it just feels like the cupboards are bare. That's all. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like. I'm live right now on Twitch. I'm going to be finishing off my Iron Lord title, I think, today. So come over, say hello, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.